All right, so this should be a relatively easy job. This car is pretty much brand new, so getting it clean shouldn't be difficult. All right, so first step is to clean the wheels with Green Star. You guys will see how much of a pain these wheels are to get in between of. All right, so first step is rinse and wash. This truck is already relatively clean. It's brand new. The only thing that's gonna make this detail take longer is just how big everything is. Other than that, this is gonna be a very straightforward, easy thing to do for the truck is just apply the coating. We're gonna just decontaminate it just like normal. We'll polish it and then we'll put the coating on. It's not gonna need any other significant detailing because it's essentially brand new. The next step after washing it is going to be to clay the vehicle and use an iron remover and the rinse list has the clay lubricant. This is gonna decontaminate the vehicle and get it ready for polishing and coating. Even though the vehicle is brand new, it still needs to be decontaminated. It was transferred probably over rail and then on a truck. So all that brake dust needs to be removed before we put the coating on. All right, we've rinsed it off. Let's dry it off and pull it back. So I'm able to dry this whole truck with just this one towel. If I wanted to get it completely dry, I would use a second one. But since we're gonna be polishing, uh, we only have to get it about 85% dry. We'll blow dry the rest and then go straight to polishing. I'm gonna move the camera so I can back this up. All right, and now we can start polishing. Now this is technically my test spot. I'm gonna make sure that this gave me decent results. And if it did, we'll continue it on the rest of the truck. If not, then I'll find some other combination to use. Yeah, that looks way better. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's definitely like 80, 80, 85%. And for a black truck, one year coating, it's gonna get polished again in another year probably. This looks great. All right, so there's really not a whole bunch of talking for me to do about this one. Essentially, it's basically just a one-step polish. I'm just gonna knock it out, put some music on, and uh, I don't know, maybe I'll do a time lapse or some shit, but whatever, let's go. All right, all polished up, ready to be wiped down and coated. So the wipe down step is very important. This is gonna remove all the waxes and oils from the polishing step previously. We need this surface to be extremely clean for the coating to properly bond to the surface. All right, time to put the coating on. Short nap towel first, and then the long nap afterwards. Putting the coating on is a relatively simple process. It's basically wipe on, wipe off. You just have to know exactly how long to keep the product on before wiping it off, and making sure that you're not wiping off too much product. You want to leave enough on the surface to coat the vehicle. All right, I'll do the other side off camera and we'll be done. Put some tire gel on the tires. We use the brush because we can get in all these little knobs on the tires here. And I did the tires first, that way I could wipe the wheels down 
and anything that I get on the tires or on the wheels, I can just wipe away. Then I'll just wipe the wheel down. All right, I didn't have time the following day to make a uh, video, but I took a couple pictures real quick while we pulled it outside. Um, thanks for watching, guys. It came out great.